Welcome to Biology Exams for You, a site dedicated to support students preparing for different competitive exams in life sciences. In this presentation, we are going to discuss a topic how to prepare for CSAR UGC net life sciences. First of all, we should have a thorough knowledge about the exam pattern. This exam is a single paper test having MCQs consisting of three parts. Part in part A, you have to write 15 MCQs out of 20 questions each carrying 2 mark. In part B, you have to write 35 questions out of 50 carrying 2 mark. In part C, you have to answer 25 questions out of 75. 0.25 mark for each wrong answer. Duration is 3 hours and maximum mark 200. Now, let us move on into a slide that will tell you how much you need in order to qualify this exam. And this is an interesting detail that was published in CSAR UGC website. You need just 42% of mark to qualify net previously. For JRF, you just need 47 mark percent mark. And that will tell you how much difficult is this exam. So you have to prepare accordingly. You don't get distressed if you are not getting answers while looking previous question papers. Now let us have a look into questions pattern. In the first part, there is a slight change this time. This part comprising of logical reasoning, graphical analysis, uh, numerical ability, quantitative comparison, etc. So I have given in the slide we have given a question. You can see that no normally many questions are, are just judging your mental ability, numerical ability like that. So you have to have a thorough preparation or a practice preparation for that in order to write, uh, in order to answer these such questions. Hopefully you should take care of this uh, session better by dealing with some practice tests. In the second part, all the questions are from your syllabus. In B part, let us take an example, a question, mode of action of anti-cancer drug methotrexate. And in this, you can see that the answer is trifolate reductase by inhibiting DNA synthesis and this is a hardcore biochemistry question and I will give you another question which class of immunoglobulins will increase in the case of chronic infection and you know that in primary immune response IgG is involved and IgG is the answer and you can expect some questions which are very easy most often very hardcore questions now let us have a look into some more question at times you may get some very easy questions like this among the following which is a gaseous hormone uh, most probably you, you may be knowing this ethylene is the answer but most often the questions are from uh, very deep questions you should have an in-depth knowledge in order to answer that mast cells have receptor 4 you know that mast cells are related to hypersensitivity reaction the immunoglobulin that is involved in hypersensitivity reaction is IgE and, and therefore mast cells are having a receptor IgE on its surface so you have to link many things in order to answer a question and uh, now moving into the next part this is the most difficult part that is the C part here you will be having an elaborate question with number of statement most often 10 to 12 lines so you just read and reread the question following are the statements regarding a plant growth hormone you have six statements so in, you have to select different options A, B, C, A, B, C, D, D, E, F. So in order to answer this question, you should know the all the statements associated with the question in order to pick out the right answer. So this is actually testing your in-depth knowledge in that particular topic. And you should so take time to pick out the right answer carefully. And in this section, keep in mind that you have 75 question you just have to write 25 only 10 to 15 question if you are thorough that it is right that is enough so these are very tough questions read and reread uh, the question carefully before reaching a conclusion then regarding the site biology exams for you is site dedicated for providing support to students preparing for different competitive exams in life sciences 
Uh, this site provides syllabus, exam pattern, detailed notes, previous solved question papers, exam preparation tips, books, resources, MCQs and more. Best wishes for your exam. Keep visiting www.biologyexamsforyou.com. Thanks for watching.